Hey, I'm Tim. Me and my kids love these Funko collectible boxes. We are big into the Marvel Collector Core, and we're getting some of the Star Wars bounty boxes. But these boxes have a lot of great stuff in them. One of the things that it comes with are some patches and some pins. But right now, we do not know what we're going to do with them. But today, I have an idea. So stick around. Okay, everything I'm going to use for this project is pretty much all scrap that I had around the house. The only thing I did buy, I did buy some cork and some black fabric. Alright, now I'm doing this build all on the fly, I have no plans. All I know is this piece of plywood that I have, I, it's the biggest I can make it because that's the size that I had currently in the garage. So, we'll work around that. All right, let's begin. Now like this, wish I would have known about this a long time ago, I used this semi-gloss paint. It was a little rough, I took some very fine steel wool, give it a little rub down, nice and smooth, no more bumps, and I gave it a little bit of a matte finish. All right, we're gonna try out the rigid hyperdrive brushless cordless brad nailer. We're gonna load our staples. Insert our battery, and let's try it out. It's got single shot and multi shot. Alright, let's do it again. Alright, there we have it. I like it. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun making stuff with this. All right, there we go. We got our two pin boards up. Got my Funko patches and pins on these ones. I'm gonna make another one, probably for just some patches over on the other wall. But if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel so you can see our upcoming videos. Also, check us out on Facebook. Like always, get out there, 
build something and have some fun doing it. Thanks for watching.